So let's put it back together. You know, putting it back together is basically uh, the opposite of uh, <laughs> taking it apart. Now, if you have the um, hammer up, go ahead and pu uh, push it back down when you push it down until it clicks and then put it back on um, safe. And the main reason you do that is, is you don't want to mistakenly hit that trigger and that thing pops up. So let's go ahead and put it back on safe. Uh, we're going to put our buffer uh, tool back in. And basically, all we're going to do is just slide that bit in there. And then we got that little pin up there. Just slide it in until it clicks behind that pin. And that's it. Your lower receiver is back together. All right, cool. All right, so we'll put the... Uh, Bolt carrier group uh, back together. We'll start with the bolt. Um, you got two little holes pointing up, and this tractor just to I've got mine to the what's that to the left. So we'll put it in there. And we'll put in the cam pin, and we'll turn it uh, 90 degrees. Pull We will <clears throat> insert the firing pin and just drop it in from the top. Slide it on the end. Now we'll put it back together. The bolt, um, when you're putting it back into the uh, bolt carrier, um, into the upper, you want to make sure that's all the way back. If it's up, um, it's not going to fit in there. So, um, all right, so put the charging handle back in. You got two little notches on the side here. We're going to find the notches on the inside. Slide it, slide right in, and just push it in until it, you know, doesn't, uh, it doesn't uh, fall out. Take your BCG and slide it right in there. And push it in. Click right in. Alright, so now the upper is good. You got an upper and you got your lower. So basically what we're gonna do now is just put the hook it up on the pivot pin here and push it in. Alright, and we will down bam good to go all right so now we got everything back together but we need to do a function check to make sure we didn't screw everything up all right so we're going to load an empty magazine all right I'm going to pull my charging handle to the rear and the magazine should catch it hit the bolt release slam it shut the magnet release, it should come down. Uh, it's safe. I'm going to pull it again. It closes. Press the trigger. We're in safe. Nothing happens. Put it to fire. Bang. It shoots. Not going to fire now. Fire. All right. We are good to go. So yeah, and the reason you want to do a function check is just to make sure, even though it's, it's pretty simple and everything to take apart that you didn't do anything wrong or something happened. So you know, if you if you got it on safe, I'm go safe yeah. you got it on safe and you press the trigger and it goes back, you got a problem. So but yeah, that's just the basic uh, disassembly, reassembly of the AR-15. We'll go more in depth when we do the. Uh, cleaning video and I, I've used this one a lot uh, for uh, reviews uh, and I reviewed a couple of uh, scopes and things on it so yeah it's 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 dirty but who doesn't run that AI dirty but we will we'll clean it on the uh, video so uh, stay tuned for that any questions or uh, comments you got about uh, disassembly or reassembly of AR-15 uh, drop me a line below um, until then you guys stay safe shoot straight keep training we'll talk to you guys later if you're a believer in the Second Amendment, 
please help us spread our message and defeat these social media anti-gun algorithms. We are a small channel, but you can help our voice be heard by leaving a comment, liking the video, subscribing to the um, to the channel, or even um, hitting the bell button to make sure you're notified when we push a video out. We're here to speak for you and make sure that your, uh, your voice is heard and that your rights are not infringed. You can also help us support the channel. There's the link below where you can go buy a and tactical gear, pick you up a hat, <laughs> a shirt, you know, whatever, to just kind of help uh, support the channel going forward. So, until next time, stay safe, shoot straight, keep training, and carry a gun daily to keep you and your family safe. We'll talk to you guys next time.